Hi, gang. Sorry, I'm over half an hour late. For those of you who figured that I'd start at two, you're not crazy. That's how it usually is. I have had a, a crazy day. Um, I, yeah, I warned of this in previous streams. I have a crazy week. Like, the whole week coming up is insane. Um, and yeah, so I just got back from... Th I had to do... I'm like in charge of fundraising in the fraternity that I'm in, so I had to run like a three hour long uh, bake sale that went right up until about half an hour ago and I just like sprinted to my car, drove back and frantically set up my stream. So hopefully, also I just set up all my computer stuff last night. So there might be some tech issues. Please let me know if you hear any buzzing sounds. I'm actually gonna be quiet for a second. Uh oh, hold on, let me turn off my fan. Okay, you guys need to be honest if you hear a buzzing noise. Ideally, it's just ambient noise because yesterday my window broke in my apartment. Uh, I tried to crank it open to get some cool air in here, and it went clunk, and the like whole window like punched out of the wall, and the screen like fell on me. <laughs> so my window is stuck like completely wide open right now. So all and I'm like my room is situated right next to like the huge unit that powers the whole building in, in terms of like heat and it just goes like all day so there's some ambient noise that will be pretty endless okay Are you still in spring break nope i had my first day of class back from spring break yesterday so back to school um i gotta do some mod downloading because we we discussed last time that we were gonna get the fruit tree honey mod those who who couldn't make it to our last starter valley stream um i have found my identity for this playthrough and that is fruit trees fruit trees is something that i always thought were kind of wasted in the base game because they are just always like a losing proposition financially and they're so expensive that you really don't can't like reliably afford a good amount of them until you're late enough in the game where they don't move the needle at all so they're really just like an aesthetic piece or if you need like a community center item or something so i've just downloaded a ridiculous amount of mods that uh screw with fruit trees and uh, we're using that <laughs> to, to make so I've got uh, Mods basically let me let me see here. I've got um, Mathematic orchards which le gives them more value I've got the biggest one is the it's, it's called like fruit tree tweaks and Last stream we had a, a town hall where I let y'all pick where we were gonna put all the sliders and the where it's set now is that the fruits that grow are random sizes. A tree can hold up to 10 fruits at a time. And the trees themselves mature uh, in two days <laughs> rather than the 28 uh, in the normal game. Uh, sorry for always having these like extensive periods at the beginning of streams where I got to download shit. So I'm, I'm downloading mods. Thank you for your continued patience. I also need to download something called producer framework mod. Okay, let's address the elephant in the room. Uh, Stardew Valley, I think, just got an update. Uh, I think it, I think the update just came out right when I started streaming by pure chance, which is incredibly unfortunate because it means that the Smappy website itself might crash. Um, so, Stardew Valley just received the 1.6 update everyone has been raving about online. I somehow didn't hear about it or know about it at all until, like, only a few weeks ago, and then now it's, like, my, today it's been my whole, like, Twitter feed. Um... So I'm sure every everybody and their mom right now is either streaming or like recording a Stardew Valley 1.6 demo or playthrough to go ahead and get out into the YouTube algorithm while they can, uh, which makes sense. So I'm sure a lot of people on Twitch are streaming the new mod right now. So I'm so sorry, moderators. Uh, you're going to have to prepare to batten down the hatches because there's going to be a million people coming in and asking if this is the new update. <laughs> so I'm so sorry, moderators right here. You're going to get really sick of saying, no, these are mods. No, this is separate. No, we're playing with mods. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'll try to say it as often as I can myself to help y'all out. Um, let's see. I need something called Producer Framework mod. Producer Framework. Here we go. Thank y'all for your uh, ever everlasting and continued patience. I appreciate it. I've had a hell of a day, and I'm really excited to... Um, Play some Stardew Valley. Uh, another game that came out, like this is an update, a whole game that came out yesterday at midnight, is um, 
I'm gonna itch my neck. Came out about 10 minutes ago, and so I just immediately crashed. Oh, shit. Um, but the new MLB The Show game is out. Came out at midnight. MLB The Show 24. Those of you who are long-time watchers of the channel, you might know that occasionally I used to play a little bit of uh, MLB The Show uh, at the end of streams. Like, sometimes I'd finish up an Animal Crossing and be like, we got an hour left. Let's play some MLB The Show for giggles. Uh, and I've got it on my PS5. So once I hook up a capture card to that, that could be a really fun thing to do on stream. Uh, we can make another, we can make another OC. And uh, one of the new things in this newest MLB The Show game is uh, you, you now have the option to make a woman player. Uh, because as, as over the last year, there have been a lot of leaps and bounds in um, women in the league. Like the, the first first woman in Division One baseball happened. Uh, first woman head coach happened. First woman head broadcaster. As all, there's basically the last year has been like a, a revolution of uh, women in Major League Baseball. So newest in the game is is you don't have to make a dude. <laughs> so we will not be making a dude for our player this time around. We'll be making a lovely lady. Uh, but that'll be a fun thing to do on stream. Okay. Yes, good good pinned comment that starts with, in all caps, it's not going to matter, like, unfortunately. But it's it, it's a great thought. Because <laughs> we, we both know no one reads the pinned comment, unfortunately. But that's smart. Okay. Okay. Now, I've downloaded two new mods. So that should be all good to go. L please allow me just a little bit to get my bearings here. Okay. Um, I'm also going to eat some Funyuns. I'm going to be hungry on stream because I usually like to eat right before I start streaming. And this time I couldn't. The way my day works out. Okay. I paused the update before Starter Valley could update. Because I'm anxious that the game updating is going to break all my mods. So the update has been paused. Ideally, this will be fine. Let me try launching Smappy. Okay. Yeah. Started by 1.5.6. Phew! All right. We will not be playing new update. There are plenty of other folks you can watch who will do that. I'm really invested in this playthrough. Um, and before you ask, I will likely not be doing like a 1.6 playthrough. At least for a while. Maybe way off in the distance we can play with the new farm that I think they added. But for now, I'm just playing this expanded stuff because it, it's I'm into it. Okay, let me, um, cue this up. Here we go. Back at it. Let me, uh, increase the game volume a little bit. There we go. All right, Ickle. We are on day 16 of summer, year one. I'm a Kretz farm. For those of you who are not staying up to date with it, no update. It's fruit tree time. That's right. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I'm blowing every single dollar I make. Every single dollar I make on fruit trees immediately. Terrible business model, but it's what we're doing. Okay, thunderstorm tomorrow. Days in my hands. Isn't it always? Okay, so. It's going to take me a bit to like... Oh, that's right. We're doing a lot of farm design stuff as well. Oh, I didn't uh, do animation. I got to launch animation canceling. I just booted up my computer for the first time last night to play Fortnite and then did nothing else on it. <laughs> so, there we go. Okay, now it should work, right? There we go. All right, let's pet the doggy dog. How, 
Oh, we just lost a hefty amount of frames. Hopefully that'll stop happening once I like kind of... Look at that! The orange is like glitching out. It's so big. Okay. You know what? Something I'm going to do... Oh, cool. Uh, something I'm going to do for my own benefit. I'm going to put color variation on like 20. Because the green looking oranges make me sad. Because they look ugly. All right, done. All right, well, we have all our fruit trees. These ones are all going to grow. Those are going to grow. We've got them everywhere. We've got mods that let them grow wherever in only two days. So I'm literally, I'm cheating is the gist. I'm just cheating. But y'all supported it. Uh, which is great because I'm way into it. Um, our grass is growing too. This looks nice, man. I, I had my doubts about this kind of natural farm shape. And I, a lot, I know a lot of people said it annoyed them that I'm like doing it like this. But I'm, I'm like way into this look. The like uneven sprinklers just kind of shit strewn about wherever. I'm actually super into how that looks. This area right here. This is today's focus. This zone right here, which will be trees, 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 as far as the eye can see. And bee houses as well. We're going to be grinding for bee houses. That's going to be today's focus. To craft a bee house. 40 wood, 8 coal, an iron bar, and a maple syrup. Do we have the recipe for tree fertilizer yet? We don't. Okay, so we should also work on foraging levels. Because maple syrup is going to be the, the hold up. Um, iron bars and coal we can buy or grind for pretty easily. We've already got a couple grown maple trees we can tap. These are all starting to grow at the same time, which is awesome. Um, okay. In that case, let's go um, cut hardwood for starters. Because that'll give us some foraging XP. We're going to cut some hardwood. Um... I think we should buy coal rather than farming it. I think that's a better use of our... Because we're going to have a lot of money. Ah, oh, but fruit trees are really expensive. And I also want enough at the end of the season to do cranberries. Okay. Uh, here's what we're going to do. I think. I'm going to pause. I'm going to go ahead and figure out how much money we need to have at the end of the season for all the cranberries we want. Uh, Stardew Valley Cranberry... They are 240. So 240. I can't remember how many. I think I made 50 sprinklers. So that's what? 800 or 400? Not 400. Or not 800. 400 times 240 should be. What? 990? Okay, hold on. I'm trying to mental math this. 240 times 400 should be like 96,000 gold. I think. So we need to make sure we have 96,000 gold by the end of the season. So we should actually cool it on the spending for a good while. So I guess instead of just crafting a bunch of bee houses, buying a bunch of coal, I'm just going to slowly stockpile lots of iron, lots of wood, lots of copper for tappers. So wood. We're going to need a lot of wood. So that's going to be what we do today. We're going to do uh, hardwood cutting, normal wood cutting, and foraging. Working on that forage skill, trying to get uh, uh, tree seed, tree fertilizer. There you go. Jesus. Uh, I'm leaving these trees on my farm because I like them. And I'm instead just going to cut down all the ones in the southern forest. Let's see. Where's my little uh, path to the forest? I think it's that way. I think I missed it. Whatever. Let's go this way. Yeah, I don't actually know how many things are new in 1.6. Because, like, from what I can tell, if it's just, well, like, like starting over a new playthrough to try and get some new 1.6 stuff, for the most part, would just be, like, playing the game. Because I'm sure it would take a while to get to the point where you can, like, explore all the new stuff. I mean, we could always hop into my... If I wanted to, which I don't. <laughs> but if I, if I was trying to do, like, a 1.6 demo, we could always hop into my perfection file. Just wander around. There's a lot more uh, hardwood stumps on this one, which I appreciate. Nope. Stupid dummy. Yeah, it's going to take me like until like 30 minutes into the stream to like be stable and have an idea of what I want to do and be making good commentary. Is the game audio okay? Because I can never tell with this game just how piercing some of the sounds are. It like looks really loud on OBS, but then I listen to it afterwards and I'm like, oh, that's, that's good. 
Oh, it was good? Cool. Just let me know, because the game audio might be too loud. That's new. It's a poison mushroom. Potentially fatal if consumed. Cool, I'll sell it. Or I'll give it to, like, Elliot or something. I don't know. Little asshole had it coming. Level 7 foraging. Not sure what level we have to get to to get tree fertilizer. If it's 7, that's incredibly clutch. There's another poison mushroom down here. Look at all these treats. You can eat. Treats for eats. Stupid. Dumb. Idiot. Oops, I wasted that. Stupid dumb idiot was me the whole time. How about that for like an M. Night Shyamalan twist? Another poison mushroom. You intrigue me. Nope. It's a dummy. Dummy. And berries. The new secret woods in this in this mod are just beautiful. Oh, I can't pick those. That's right. Uh, oh, I'm out of space. Okay, well, let's uh, do some compartmentalizing. Let me eat this mushroom. All right, now we leave. Whoa there. Whoa there. Whoa there. Calm down. It's literally just a game. Oh, my God. Baby. Okay, maybe we should head back and drop some stuff off before continuing on. Because anything we find, we're basically not going to be able to pick up. Let's just cut some trees. This is good. I got my steel axe. This is exciting for me. I kind of figured that since the title of my stream is uh, Let's Play Stardew Valley Expanded with Expanded in all caps and then part six um, that maybe that'll fend off a lot of people who might be confused about thinking and playing the update uh, but then I remember that a lot of people don't read titles the number of times on YouTube streams that someone would say like I'm not trying to public shame really, if this just happened no problem um but <laughs> the number of times people would come into like youtube streams and be like what game is this and it's like my friend it's the first word in the title oh i'm getting tired okay hold on you know what? i'm gonna eat my cake yum is the new update really that big? Because I, like, didn't follow it at all. And the only things I know that are new are there's a new farm type. And, uh, I don't know. That's actually really it. And seasonal outfits. That's it. Those are the two things I know about this one. I'm sure I'm forgetting about a lot. Hello? Worked combat a bit. New pets. Ah. Oh, yeah. This is technically spoilers. We shouldn't talk about this, probably. That's on me. I literally completely forgot that some people don't want to be spoiled. Dude, I'm popping off on the wood front right now. Okay, I want that spice berry. Fine. Thanks. There's another one over there. Come for you next. I'm proud of us to, that we're already at level 7 foraging. That's my favorite skill to get high up. Our skills actually as a whole are... Well, combat's pretty sad. But besides that, like, our skills are solid. Foraging is easily my favorite skill to get to a high level. Level 10 foraging. Oh my god. 
my favorite thing in the whole game. I know technically Artisan is the best perk, but like, I don't care, dude. The like, Iridium, all four tools are Iridium. Smokes. Uh, uh, I'll eat these silver ones. So it's recommended to restart to get the full experience because of how big it is. Oh, now I'm so curious. Oops. I might just do that on my own time. This is great. Oh, that's almost a stack of wood. Once I have like an iridium axe and I can just like shred through this whole forest, that'll be great. Capitalist dreams. Um, I'm assuming these both are, yeah, just a lot of like icky. Um, this gives you stuff. I want, I want to save like my big stack of gold spice berries because it's the kind of thing that I like to like have on me at the mines. Nine. Okay, let's go out there. Neat. All right, I got a stack of wood. That's great. I'm gonna keep working my funyuns on my walk home. I'm gonna try and only eat funyuns at boring times that I know will be cut out of the final product. <laughs> oh. Let's take the shortcut up. I forgot there's a shortcut straight to my farm. This new Papa's game. Yeah, it's only on mobile as far as I can tell, though, so I can't play it. Whoops. Fat lag right there for some reason. Okay. Let's dump. Uh, I'm not planning to play any Papa's games soon. I've been feeling like slightly, a slight bit of Papa burnout as of late. So, I'm going to take five on Papa's. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be very upset by that. This is the cycle of, of YouTube. Is I find something that I really like to do and, and a video of it does really well. And then I do like a bunch more because it's fun. And I like the videos. And, um, and it's great. And then I start to get like a little tired of it. I'm like, alright, I'm ready to move on to something new. But then people, all of a sudden, that's the only thing. Good night. All of a sudden, that's the only thing people talk about in my streams. Where now, like, I've probably for the next year, every stream I ever do, someone's gonna either make a reference to Papa's or ask me to play Papa's. And then I get sick of it. It's like a circle. That's what I'm with Wobble Dogs. Um, oh, that one with the Lamb. Tree fertilizer is huge. That is awesome. Most of our trees should be grown up today, huh? I'm pretty sure. Thunderstorm, so we're going to want to be out and about as much as we can today. Get all of our lightning rods struck. Love you, boo. Terrible luck day. Not that it really matters. Yep, look at all our beach ball sized fruits that have grown here. And a tiny orange. <laughs> it's like a grape. Look at that! 
that one! It's not even on the tree anymore! Dude, look at them all. They all grew up. Oh my god. I'm just gonna like waste some time to wander around for a little if that's cool with y'all. I just wanna look at all my trees. Look at all our fruit trees back here! I also wanna get a bunch more grass to throw everywhere. We're gonna put a bench there, bench here, bench here. This is great! That one's done. This one's gonna actually take like the full time because I planted it before I downloaded the basically a cheat mod. Apricot's done. These are normal trees. Also, in case y'all missed it, I said it out loud <laughs> though. Uh, tree fertilizer, that's huge. So um, let's see here. Let me put this away. Uh, we're saving the ancient fruit because we're gonna uh, seed maker that in the, in the future. Let's put everything away for now except these two. Um, we got plenty of stone, not a lot of fiber. So we're gonna spend today, I think, in the mines grabbing a bunch of fiber. Um, I think we'll go on floor 20 and get all the fiber, copper, and stone we can. So we're gonna be breaking gray rocks. We're not gonna do the big rocks because the stone isn't as pressing. We're gonna be breaking the gray rocks because they can have coal in them and some stone. We're gonna be breaking all the bushes and all of the um, copper nodes so we can start working on some tappers. I really like my farm. I know a lot of people are not into it <laughs> and let me know with the like unnatural shape of it, but I'm a huge fan. For the day off college tomorrow, I'm deciding if I should continue playing Metopia. Play the new Stardew Valley update. I don't know anything about Metopia. Um, I need to find like a full list. Do y'all know if there's somewhere I could access like a full list of everything added in the new update? I can give that a look see. Tamodachi live stream would be so silly. What platform is that on? It's her name's Twitter. Gotcha. 3DS. Oh well shit. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna put on a hoodie. I couldn't do um, webcam today because um, I finished the designs of my three new uh, shirts slash hoodies for Filthy Casual and they all got shipped to me today and I'm wearing one of them. I don't want to spoil it yet because I can't actually start advertising it or make the design live until I get uh, like a photo shoot done that I can use to advertise. But exciting stuff. I think they look really cool. I think it's, it's one of those things where it's like exactly the kind of shirt I wanted to make that look has like a whack enough look that I'm sure a lot of people are gonna think it's super ugly. Uh, but I really like it. I mean, to that was actually pretty easy. Oh well, then I'm gonna put that on my wheel spinner. Oh, I forgot I need to break. I just need to like calibrate. I'm used to just looking for ore in the mines. How long are you gonna be here in the mine? Jesus. Uh, Look at all that coal. I really want to look at the patch notes now because I'm so curious. Work on some funions and catch up on chat.
Um, let's put everything of interest in the hot bar, which is these four things. Not great so far, but that's okay. It's okay. I need a magnet ring or something. I have one. Ignore me. Eh. in another area code. How did I kill you? I have to itch my ear. Ah! Ah ah! God damn it. Allergy season. Gross. I'm back in the like sinus world where my ear gets like really plugged and itchy and it's a specific sensation where when I itch it, like that happens all year because I just got all kinds of wax sinuses and it's like, ah, my ear's itchy. But I'm now back at the point where, like, my sinuses are so screwed that, like, rubbing my finger in my ear makes me, like, want to throw up. It makes me car sick. Gross. Icky. There's some bushes. Give me that. Thanks. Third, you should see an ENT. I know y'all mean well, but with all due respect, I've seen everybody about everything. Trust me. I promise. You all are very kind to be concerned about my health, but I promise I've seen everybody about everything forever. And I'm drinking water. <laughs> I swear to God. That's the one that gets me. For every other thing, it's like, that's really sweet that you're concerned about me, but no worries. And then for when people are like, drink more water, I'm like, hey, I could like find you and then wring your neck out. I like to round myself on the daily. I'm the most hydrated man around. Speaking of. Uh, there you go. But yes, I'm not saying like, hey, fuck you for saying, hey, you should go see a professional. <laughs> That's a great point, and it's, I'm very, uh, whatever the word is, very grateful that you guys care about my health. So, thank you. Yeah, I have like a Tervis tumbler of, um,. It's like this little plastic cup with a plastic lid and like a purple straw. And I carry it with me every- I take it to parties. <laughs> I show up to frat parties with a Tervis tumbler of water. It means so much to me. And then I, uh, my friend and I broke into the school's bat baseball field because we wanted to play wiffle ball on it at night. And we had to hop this really tall fence and it shattered on entry. And I was devastated. Uh, but then I found another one that is identical to it, so it's like it never happened. Yeah. Questions are great, but are either expensive or have really long waiting lists. Yeah, usually both. Blows. Took me half of a calendar year to get into a cardiologist. So they could be like, yeah, that thing you knew you had, you have it. It's like, thanks. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you. That'll be $400,000. Thanks, guys. I was so incensed at how much I had to pay for my 10 minute CAT scan that revealed nothing. It was the briefest medical procedure. I was in the building and then back out in less than half an hour and they were like, yeah, that'll be hundreds of dollars just for me to hit go on this machine and for it to tell you like, hey, now your head's normal. It's like, are you fucking serious? Stupid. Oh, Jesus. 80 fiber is great. 109 stone is also great. 26 copper is not great. And 6 coal is not great. But hey, you take the good, take the bad. Um, take the moon, take the sun. Rada, 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 rada. I'm gonna kill this guy. 
For the thrill of it! You too. No one's safe. Alright, cool. Boyfriend has to remind me to drink water. I actually was about to drink water, isn't it? I also just got days without water. I got a sip of a straw or whatever for hours. So you got a bottle with a straw and I'm hydrated. Yeah, that, me too. That's exactly, I like, I'm just a naturally incredibly forgetful person about everything. And I feel so bad because there have been so many times where I've like really upset people who mean a lot to me <laughs> because I've like forgotten like close friends where it's like, dude, I forgot it was your birthday or like, oh my God, I forgot blah. And I'm not trying to defend myself because that's just bad. I need to get better at that. But the point is, I will forget about important shit all the time, including drinking water. So for a while, I was not hydrated because I would just forget that I need a drink. And then, yeah, I got this thing with a straw in it. And now it's like, dude, I freaking love sucking on things. <laughs> so now I'm like drinking water all the time because I just suckle it from my straw. It's a great time for everyone involved. Gotcha. Silly geezer. Yay. New here, but I've been watching YouTube for months. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Sun. Uh oh. Sunshy NBA. <laughs> Yo, you play for the Suns? Is that Devin Booker? <laughs> nice to meet you, too, Devin Booker. Or, are you, or is it Kevin Durant? Sunshine, I see. Well, welcome to Twitch. I'd like to think we have fun here. Yusuf Nurkic? Oh my god. The Grayson Allen? It makes me so upset that he's actually having a good year. Fuck that guy. Everybody, join, join me in cursing upon Grayson Allen, please. Mean, mean man. He played for Duke and was an asshole. And then now he plays for the Suns and is an asshole. Leave mines. He hurt my Pookie Wookie Alex Caruso. Oh, did he really? What a turd. Are you like a Bulls fan or do you just really like <laughs> Alex Caruso? I would respect either. Probably the latter more, if I'm being honest. Because <laughs> that would just be funny. Broke his wrist last year. I uh, I didn't start following the NBA until this year, so I had no idea. Unfortunate Bulls fan. Yeah, that is an awful shame. <laughs> Don't. Oh, you bastard! Whatever. 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 Have you considered uh, dying and murder dying? Did not work out for me. There you go. Yeah. Give me more coal. I want more coal out of these rocks. Beep, 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 beep. Seven forty p.m. We should scram a little soon because it takes longer to get back than it does in the base game. There's so much delay on my mic that I'm sure it sounds like I'm super upbeat and that like hurts my ego because I have a pretty good sense of rhythm and I hate that on stream it looks like I don't. I also have a headache so I'm going to take five right here <laughs> once I get up this ladder. Advil! Skipping the song because I remember it has words in it and I don't like that. Okay. I'd wheel. I'd wheel. My, um, I was playing Fortnite with my friend yesterday and he was talking about, he, uh, he was my roommate in freshman year. So you can actually hear him laughing sometimes in some of my streams or videos from back in like whenever that was 2021 2022 um he's in the joint degree program so he's in scotland the last couple years and then he's coming back to my school this coming year and apparently they're making him <laughs> they're making him take intro to hindi 
and he's he's he grew up in India. So like his babyhood was his intro to Hindi, but they're making him take it. <laughs> so he's going to be taking this intro to Hindi class with this white dude trying to teach him his native like his first language. So that's pretty great. <laughs> okay. I took my Advil. Let me uh get get in like a more favorable position here. My legs are all twisted up weird. There you go. I've got very sleepy eyes today. I'm having trouble keeping my eyes open today. I like slept okay last night, but some days I just have like sleepy eyes. This be one of those days. Arr! I don't know why I said this be as if I'm a dangle dang pirate. It's all the pollen. That's a great point. You're totally right. I'm so dumb. <laughs> I don't know. I not put two and two together. Wait, oh, just so better. No, and also for whatever reason, I'm having eye problems. Yeah. Usually, it used to be that the um, pollen would make my eyes water uh, with my old contacts. And it would just mean that my old contacts would fall out a lot when I would blink. You know, I just use them, which was annoying in its own sense. But now I've got these new ones that are specifically made to um, combat dry eye to prevent like that thing I kept complaining about, about how I would go for a while without blinking and then my eyes would glaze over and then I'd be like, all right, next time I blink, they're gonna come out and they always would. Uh, and they're supposed to like keep your eyes m more like moist because um, they're made with like a better material. So I have those now, but the unfortunate side effect of that is level five. Now, instead of um my eyes like watering and my contacts falling out when I don't blink or during allergy season. They just burn. Like my contacts stay in nice and square and they don't get distorted, which is awesome. But they burn like hell. So now like every night it feels like there's like hydrogen peroxide in my eyes. Like they just burn every time I close them. They just sting horribly, which is annoying. But I push through it. <laughs> I push through it when I'm playing. NBA 2K with my friends because I want I don't know I want to win. Uh, I've been taking a lot of L's the last th that's the that's been the theme of um like more than usual the theme of the last like few months of gaming for me has been just like hum hum humbling it's been a humbling experience because I play I don't know I play a lot with my friends from home and for a while we would play Rocket League and in our like little friend group I'm I I think I'm the best at Rocket League. So it was nice to be like the best at something. But for the last like three months, all we've been playing is Fortnite and NBA 2K, which are two games where I am just like unquestionably the undisputed worst at in our friend group, just like pretty new to both games. Uh, so I've had to come to grips with just kind of being the worst for a few months. Um, and then I went skiing for the first time. Or spring break, which was more just being the worst at something. A lot of humbling. Um, yeah. I've played extremely little Fortnite in my life, so I'm just not good at it because I've like barely played. I barely played like any shooters, so I just have no experience in that whole genre. And then 2K, I mean, I just I got the game recently, and it's kind of game where it takes a while to pick it up. Yeah. So yeah, very humbling. And it's like I, that I'm not used to because like, or I mean that, that for the most part I am used to because by and large growing up in my little like three person friend group, I was usually the worst at any given thing. Cause I was like, I don't know. I was the youngest in the group and the smallest and the least skilled <laughs> at most things. So I'm not, I'm not being the worst at something in that friend group is not a new experience for me, but it's a shame to go back to my roots after getting used to being pretty good at Rocket League. And that's back to like, damn it. I forgot how it feels to suck. I want to get back in time. I lost track of time like I freaking always do. Stupid dingus. Uh, next harvest of blueberries, we're going to sell and we're just going to hold on because we need to make sure we have our 94k or whatever we need for our cranberries in the fall. I'd also like to make clear that I was not bullied in my friend group. I was just the worst <laughs> at... at games of skill and all sports except baseball which obviously you don't really just play with three people oh, dude freaking i love how this is coming along man i gotta be honest and if you don't uh shut up who cares how about them apples okay let's go to bed
Our trees are bearing fruit. It's just great things are happening all around. Uh, f uh scout, please. Thank you. All right. Gremendous. Another stormy day. So, ideally, even more, um... Battery packs on the way. Let me... Dump, dump these. Just like that. All our coal is gone. This sucks, man. We've got four left. Oh, I already had a bunch of copper ore. Okay. So we're kind of squared on copper. It's really just coal. It's all coal. It's always been coal. It'll always be coal. I mean, oh, for shit's sake. There we go. Okay, we should maybe try harvesting some of our fruit and just see what kind of what kind of sales they make. Uh, let's do it. Let me dump some of this random shit off and then I'll... There we go. Okay. I'm gonna hold on to these to eat. Okay. That's it. No more coal. Um, let's harvest all our fruit trees. <laughs> Jesus Lord in heaven. The big ass oranges are awesome. Five from that one. Lots of, lots of fruit. Okay. I think that's all the summer ones. Cause I think the ones down here are like spring and fall, I believe. Cause yeah, it's, it's a uh, apricot, which is spring and that's fall. Awesome. All right. Well, we're going to, we're going to, did, apparently the fruits sell for higher uh, Due to the mod I have um, Oh yeah I, I need an orange for community center That's a good cash That's That is really good cash 4k for that Dude Yes please That is good cash Let chat say fuck Yeah you can say fuck I don't care Say whatever you want what do I look like? Your mama? Daddy? Sorry. Okay. We're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna... We're gonna make some tree fertilizer. Now. Let's see. Let me make like... 15. Alright. I want these to grow first. I think you may have missed a peach, homie. Oh, shoot. Did I miss a peach? Thanks, homie. Oh, I already did this one. There we go. Okay, and then uh, let me hit these up over here. It's a shame. I like went all in on oak trees like I always do, assuming we'd be doing a lot of kegs, but now that I want to do mainly bee houses, I wish there were more maple. Okay, done. All right. And then I guess we can fertilize the uh, two little ones down here I'd like to buy lots of coal I also gotta find the peach I missed forgot how expensive grass starter is god damn it alright peach rogue peach you're correct look at that well, two peaches okay let me, uh, well, we're going to put grass, that'll spread, grass, 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 there we go, more grass, and I want a bunch in there, but uh, we're out of fiber, uh, let's do some more grinding for fiber, and, um, I think today we just grind for fiber, like, solely fiber, Yeah. Today's gonna be just fiber. Cause I want more grass. I'm the wrong way. We need Trevor Story emote. We sh I will absolutely, I'll go ahead and say this right now. I will absolutely 100% make an emote that is just Trevor Story's face, like the baseball player. I wonder if I can do that right now. I don't know if you can add an emote while you're streaming. No. I'll do that. I'll do it another time. 
Um, yeah, I'll absolutely do that. I'm so excited. He couldn't play all year last year because he had a um, he had elbow surgery. Um, and he's back this year. He's he's really sucked so far as a Red Sox because he hasn't gotten much playing time. And the time he has gotten, he was injured, so he didn't play very well. So everyone's kind of given up on him. But I'm not. And I've been I've been in on Trevor Story since day one. He's gonna have a monster comeback season, even if he doesn't hit very well. He's an outstanding defender, which is super valuable at short. And wouldn't you know it? It's just spring training, so it's not indicative at all of how his season's gonna go. But his spring has been phenomenal. He's been hitting so well this spring, and I'm just like looking around on Twitter, like, uh, do y'all see this shit? Anybody seeing this besides me? Seen this dude just like go off like I said he probably would? Crazy how that works. Yeah, I'm all in on the Trevor Story redemption arc. Should I go to a Cubs Dodgers game? If you'd like, that could be a good game. They're both projected to be a good team. Well, the Dodgers are projected to be fucking unbeatable. Cubs are projected to be pretty good. <laughs> Do you like hockey? I've watched almost no hockey in my life and I know nothing about it, but I think I could enjoy going to a hockey game. It sounds like a fun atmosphere. Looks like a great time. I know that I know hockey is really iconic for having a great playoff atmosphere. Um I like I think the consensus of sports Twitter is well the consensus is that uh, basketball, the NBA's playoff atmospheres is last place. They just like, for whatever reason, playoff NBA games don't feel that much hyper than regular season ones. Um, I saw some lists people have made ranking like playoff atmospheres of different sports. Basketball was last place on like all of them. That's why I love baseball so much. It's like, I totally get why a lot of people are bored by it. But it's it's so like, it's such a slow burn. It's slow paced enough that playoff baseball games are so exciting because it lets excitement build so much. And like, like with basketball, the scoring is so frequent that there's not really a lot of momentum to be built. But because scoring is so infrequent, it's something like baseball or hockey. Like hockey, the scoring is infrequent, but like the lead up to a goal being scored is often very short. I love that in baseball you can like smell when runs are coming because like runners will become like like there will be runners on base and it's like oh my god this is a scoring opportunity and like it, it like really it lets the excitement build so when something big happens it just like erupts which is great like if you look up some of the like loudest playoff home runs in baseball they're so hype because like people have been sitting here for two hours Watching like this slow burn and like all this is building up and it's like oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god There are runners on base shit's happening. They're like the opposing team's pitchers finally like losing command a little bit. I love it. I love it Pass away dummy I should keep breaking these in case they pull them I really need more coal, man. This is so bad. Maybe I should farm coal instead of fiber right now. I'm just, I hate farming coal. It's so deeply. Let's do it. We'll farm coal. All right, fine. You win. You win, Stardew Valley. Zoom out for this. Okay. I thought I already had it charged. There we go. One coal. Whatever. What are you farming fiber for? I wanted to make a lot of grass starter to make my farm pretty. And also a uh, tree fertilizer for my tapper army that I'm creating. Why are we like losing some frames all of a sudden? It's odd. Oh shoot, it's also happening on stream. Are you guys also getting like kind of stuttery movement? It's like not as smooth as I want it to be. Oh, 
a little. Yeah, this is a glitch that's been happening. It's it only it's only fixed if I uh, go out of full screen. What if I go right back into it? What if instead I just go all the way into full screen? Okay, well, we'll see. Ideally, this is, this is much smoother. Damn it. I was looking over to see if there was any frame stuttering. I'm very picky about that kind of thing. Uh, don't do nothing. It looks better to me, so I'm pleased. I'm sufficiently pleased. Oh, I see y'all. Excuse me. Dummy. Oh, a diamond. We'll grab that. Ladle. Nothing. Cool. Love it. That gives you such a good amount of uh, mining XP. Busting up a diamond. Oh, that's right. I got it. I love hearing the elevator ding. The piercing elevator. Oops. Nope. Don't hear him. Balls, man. Balls. Oops. Cool. It's a mean floor. Okay. Nothing. Nothing at all. What the fart, dude? What the fart? I wonder if there's a mod to turn it off. Oh, you're totally. I'm sure there is. I would love to do that. That's something that I wish. There are a few things about this game that, that I feel like could be such a quick update fix. Changing the elevator sound or making it less piercing. And this is a big one for me. Decreasing the either decreasing the volume of scything a bush or making it so the sounds don't stack When you scythe a big group of bushes it like stacks all the sounds on top of each other And it's like a really really loud and grating sound I don't know if that's just a me thing But I've always felt that way Oops I don't know I want to gather them all. It's the best I could do. There we go. No survivors. Horse sword. I don't want it. We got three ladders. I'm killing three separate folks. Elevator ding into a fart with reverb. Somebody actually get on that. I don't know. I could probably do that myself. I could easily, like, if I find the, the file in game. Okay, time out. Um, Stardew Valley sound effects file. Game sound files. All right, whatever. Either way, I'll just need to find something that I can like, it's elevator underscore ding dot wave. Hold on. Browse local files. Content. Data effects, fonts, maps, minigames, portraits, strings. Terrain, tile sheets. There's farmer sounds, sound bake, wave bank, and wave bank. I don't think it's actually that cool things. Either way, I'll figure that out. I'll figure out a way to replace it with whatever I want. In due time. Because as it stands right now, that's like my least favorite sound in the whole game. It's so piercing. This is uh, exhilarating. And I'm up to nine coal. It's super worth my time. It was actually more efficient to literally just break all the gray rocks. So we're going to go back to doing that. This sucks. But, like, if I had the burglar ring, it wouldn't be. But I just... It'll take me so long to get that. I don't know. 
I always end up with a shortage of coal. Whatever. Floor 80 is definitely the best floor for fiber though. There's always huge patches of bushes. Okay, we got a couple coal from that. If we have like a free day, we can always do some more fishing. Cause it's been long enough that I'm not down to get back to fishing. It was just at the time on my last stream, I did it like two full days in a row and I was like, okay, we're done. <laughs> we're done with the fishing. Oops. This has been very lucrative for fiber today. That's exciting. And we have the winter grass mod, so all our grass we worked so hard on won't go away the second winter comes. Lots of good. Lots of good in the world. Lots of kindness, lots of generosity in the world. Lots of good favor. Do you guys agree? Do you guys agree that the world we live in is beautiful and whole? Cool. I think Clint says sells coal for 10 gold. Would be a steal. Uh, unfortunately, I think it's 150 a piece. Which isn't terrible, but we don't have that much room for spending right now with all the cranberries I want to buy. So. Damn it. Just give me, thank you. It's fine, it's gonna. 950, we can go a little longer. No, wait, that's like a whole patch of grass and gray rocks, and I want both of those things. Fuck you. A copper bar is helpful. Sorry I cursed at you. That's actually really nice of you. One fifty? I didn't know inflation hit Stardew Valley. Inflation? <laughs> I saw a TikTok about that. That was really funny. <laughs> uh, hello? Oh, that was a risky maneuver. Oh, the risk is still present. See you. We're leaving. It's late. Love the fog. Yeah, it's very pretty. Mmm. Funyuns are great. Oh. I'm fine. Night time. And it's Friday tomorrow. Yay! All right. 
I gotta eat more. Mm. Very tasty. Mm. <laughs> It's a Friday. It's blueberry day. Okay, let's start by watering the ancient fruit. All our big ass. It's so stupid, I can't run through there. All our uh, big ass fruit grew back. I got a tomato. It's pretty. Pretty epico. I'm fluent. Um, okay, let's go blueberry picking. Uh, we haven't donated a blueberry yet. We should do a donation run pretty soon because we have quite a few things. Man, I really need those freaking minecarts, dude. But I, I'm not going to be able to get one until I find one iron ore. at farming level nine. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. That'll get us seed makers, won't it? It's good. I can start seed makering my ancient fruit. Level nine. Oh yeah, and then technically if I if I seed maker it all tomorrow and plant it tomorrow, I'll be able to get two harvests out of them before they die, and it'll be a profit. Handy dandy. Yay, this one's all grown up. It looks great. All done. Nice. All right, so let's see. We got to uh, save one. One's already in there. Perfect. Um, we already got a tomato in there. We got all our crops. So, yeah. I can go ahead and dump this off. And then I can sell the rest. Very cool. All right. Eh. Get a snack. I'm gonna go pee really fast. I'll be right back.
I'm back. Back to work. Uh, okay. Everything's picked and sold. I'm gonna let fruit grow for a little while. Um, okay. What to do today? I'm gonna need more cash, so maybe we can do some fishing. Because I'd like to buy coal. I think that'll be far faster than trying to farm it myself. So, um, let me make as many tappers as I can. Oh, I have a lot of copper, actually. Wood sign. Let's make a couple of these. For decor. Make tons of tappers. We're squared, dude. Okay. Maple gets priority. Alright, let's just tap everything that we can right now. I made enough. Alright, well let me go ahead and make... There we go. That's all I've got. Uh, I've still got a little wood left over. And enough coal to make eight more tappers. How much wood do you need for a tapper? 40. So we don't have enough wood to make eight more tappers, but we have enough coal and copper to make eight more tappers. Let's, uh, how many more do we actually need? Let me figure out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen tappers. I've got ten, so I only need five more. So we've got enough wood and copper and coal to make it happen. Nice. Tree farm. Tree farm. Okay, let me... Then I just need one more. Nope. Gotta figure out what uh, we wanna put on our signs and where. That's good. Oh, spread around. I'm gonna put some here. <laughs> okay. Um. There we go. That'll have like a little bit of resin or something on it. Oh, it could be cute right here as well. Give me that back. Whoops. Um, there we go. Okay. I'm wasting all of today just running back and forth to my furnaces. Stupid. I was gonna go fishing. We're not going to go fishing then today because we need to get there as early as we can because the king salmon goes out of out of time pretty fast. Okay. There we go. Nice. So we're done on tappers. Um, I'm just going to keep mommy for like forever. Cool. Um, in that case, we're not really low on wood. So I guess let's go do some more wood cutting. See how much money we make today. Mm. Should check this just in case. Red cabbage seeds. Do we actually need red cabbage? I don't think we do. We do. That is huge. Nine days. Just in time. Oh my god. 
That's crazy. All right, so we'll plant those. Wow. We'll have to put a speed grow on it just to be safe. Oh, I didn't bring my hammer. Uh-oh. All right, in and out quick. I don't want to get harassed by these fools. Excuse me. Thanks. Oh, uh, I want that. Yeah, whatever. Uh, Regal, I'm using a mod called Star... That keeps happening. There's like some kind of weird like asset glitch. Um, I've got a mod called Star Blue Valley, which is my primary recolor thing. And I've also got a mod called Dynamic Nighttime that like combines with Star Blue Valley to like make this color combo I really like. Because the Dynamic Nighttime puts like a warm filter on like early and late times in Star Blue Valley, as you'd expect from the name. A little blue for my taste. It's like extremely blue. So, having that, like, warm filter, I think, really makes a nice combination. Don't touch me. What did I just say? We're leaving. Yeah, like this. I like this a lot. It's like Minecraft shaders. He's gonna be pissed. Oh wait, I forgot this is the abandoned one. I fell back into the trap. I completely forgot about the new characters. I keep falling into this trap because it's just... can't help it, man. I don't care. <laughs> Cause like I want to meet these new characters, but I get so sucked up into my own farm. That's it for me for the day. Picked up another 380 wood. Nothing to scoff at. And I guess I will bounce now. Cut through the woods. Excuse me. Excuse. Wow, masterful right there, honestly. Oh my forgeables, that's right. Let's do that. I can I can do one more round of those. Time for one more batch this summer. So I'll turn. Let's see. How many of these shitty sprinklers do I have? One, two, three, four, five. 
One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty. So eighty. Eighty spots. I've leveled up. I'm a level eight forager now. Okay, eighty. There we go. All right. And this is my last batch of these before fall. Ah, oh, fall is coming up. My favorite. It's my favorite. I'm gonna say it so many times. Whenever I don't have anything to say uh, on stream, I'm just gonna be like, I love fall. I just know it. When I was editing back the perfection streams from fall, I was like, dude, shut the fuck up. They know <laughs> that you love fall. Nobody cares. Here we go. Ding, ding, ding. Bye. All right. Now, how many how many of these do I want to keep? The grapes are good for energy. So are the spice berries. 38 silver spice berries, 19 gold ones is huge. That's getting sold. These are getting sold. Sweet peas make for great gifts. Probably. All right, now. Let's find a spot for this red cabbage seed. I'll wait until that's done, and then we'll have one sprinkler we can place somewhere. Um, to put... Red cabbage seeds and all of the uh, ancient fruit. Seed maker to ancient fruit. Alright. I could just use the spot with the blueberry dive. Smart. And we can hold off on the um, ancient fruit zone for later. Wonderful. There we go. Seed maker. That's what they look like, I guess. Lovely forging. Our skills are solid, dude. Look at that. So, we've got two more uh, blueberry harvests. So, we'll have plenty of money. If that's the case, we'll make about... We have about like 80k or so to spend on um, coal. I think we should make like a 75,000 gold investment in coal. I really do. New journal entry. Hey, who cares? <laughs> Sorry, Demetrius, but literally who cares? Okay. Seed maker. This is tough. 25 wood, 10 coal. That's the killer for me. I don't have that much. Well, we'll go buy coal today. We're going to buy coal today. Um, Because we've got the one gold bar and we've got plenty of wood. Let's see if there are any more trees to tap this morning. Yep, there's one. Probably some others as well. Yep. This one's not quite ready yet. There we go. Alright. Those two trees are still... still uh, Bruin tree fertilizer one of my favorite additions to this game easily So convenient Neato <laughs> Okay, we're getting shit at Clint's so we're gonna make a donation run out of it. So let me um Put everything away here We're actually gonna we don't have to use that right now. Because, yeah, we're waiting on our coal run anyway. All right. Super nice. So let me put that in there. <laughs> what is... Super nice. <laughs> Sometimes I say shit and I'm like... Man, really? That did not just come out of your mouth. Super nice. Okay, we're going... Oh, I never uh, watered my angel fruit. Hold on. Someone just gifted a bunch of memberships. 
Sergeant KJ. Thank you, Sergeant KJ. Okay, the chosen. What does that mean? Is that a character? I'm going to cleanse. Oh wait, hold on. Geo, geo. That's it. Oh wait, I should check if I have any things for Gunther. Just the chosen one, I guess. Smosh character. I never watched Smosh. Hi! It's Martin. I have a view of empty plains and boring old mountains back home. You're boring, Martin. See ya. Harry Potter ass. Tell him. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to Google the Chosen after the stream because now I'm curious how accurate it really is. If it sounds even close to what I sound like. Nothing here. Sock forging, we got that. Um, we'll be able to finish this soon. We can finish that easily. And that's what. All right. Kind of love Martin. Yeah, he's pretty cute. <laughs> okay, apricot. Um, I should have saved one of my jellies. I mean, we got an apple tree. We got a pomegranate tree. We got cherry. Tree. We have all the trees. We have a fruit cave anyway, so like whatever. Okay. Um. Nope. Nope. Summer crops. Here we go. Bing bang, bing bop. Well, shit. That's awkward. Okay, that's fine. Um. Yeah, we're about to have that. Neat. The part we eat. Oh, I had one of those just now. Oh, and you saved one of those. No! We have an apple tree. This is tough, man. Okay. Whatever. Let's do this. <laughs> that one iridium ore sucks, man. I really need those minecarts. You slowpoke! You the ore? I don't freaking know, dude. I hope for it from a fish fishing chest or a geo, probably. Okay. Clinty. Star shards. Who cares? It's actually new and I appreciate it. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Alright, Clint. Uh, my budget is pretty much everything I have on coal. I don't regret that even slightly. All right, we've got 450 coal to work with now. Time for everyone's weekly reminder. I don't care about this number, all right? I care about this number. And all I'm seeing right now is that we're about to eclipse 250,000 in our first summer. That's all I'm seeing. Done. Please, please. Okay. Back home. All right. Mom, mom. Now. We've got tons of coal to work with. Most of it is going to go towards bee houses. There's a bee house. Maple syrup, iron, right? Okay. We're going to need lots of iron for that. 
Again, I'd like to save fishing for a day where we can get right down at the beginning. So I don't want to do that right now. Oh. No. No. I feel so bad, dude. I've been literally snacking nonstop for this whole stream. This entire stream is going to be just played with me crunching on shit. Okay. Hi, baby! I already pet you, right? Okay. Um, let me ditch some stuff, and then we're going to go to the mines. We're going to get iron all day. All, all day. Okay. Um, I need to make a seed maker. There we go. Okay. This whole thing is adorable. <laughs> it's super cute. <laughs> Only one. That's I'm really unlucky. Getting a mixed seed from these three would be incredibly unlucky. Three. That's more like it. Uh, that's more like it. Okay, let me... Is there any space that's covered by a scarecrow that is available? Dude, right here. <laughs> right where my goddamn apple tree is. Um, okay. Well, let me go get the rest of them. Another one spot. That's unlucky. That's okay, though. Uh, I'm gonna put it... This is in range of a scarecrow. Done. Done. I forgot my hoe. Jesus. And I've got speed grow. Ding dong. All right, now. What is my iron looking like? Poor, I have almost none. So yeah, all iron today. Just, we're gonna just get in there. We're just gonna get in there and grind <laughs> for iron. <laughs> Let me do that, here we go. I'm gonna hold on to my tappers. Yay. Okay. That's today's goal. And then it'll just be a game of waiting for uh, maple syrup to brew. <laughs> And now all of our money goes towards either cranberries in the fall or more uh, fruit trees. Feeling good about my day. Oranges look like tree titties. My day just got a little bit better.
Ooh, there we go. I see you. Ooh, a bomb. Thank you. A ladder be helpful. Nope. I gotta run all the way back. Oops. I'm gonna zoom out. So I can see any little babies hanging around. Come on. I forgot there were babies there I should have killed. I was zoning out. Damn it. There we are. Are you a couple? You two were hanging awful close next to each other. Bye. That's a couple. That's a happy family. Only 87. I should be focusing more on iron than, than coal. Iron is like the be all end all right now. One hundred nine. Waste of time. I hear that. How many of you are there? A whole bunch. A whole bunch. That's why it pays to have spectacular hearing. And awareness. Up a ladder. You suck. Up to 466. Holy guacamole.
Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Sorry, I got a little impatient. Yeah, there's not much to talk about on this stream. There's a lot of grinding. A lot of grinding for ore and coal and other such resources. You're mine, by the way. All of you. Now I'm getting that weird frame starter thing. It keeps happening. I don't know what causes it. It's like after playing for a little in like one specific aspect ratio, it starts to stutter ever so slightly. I hate it. Y'all are assholes. I'm a glitter glue. Glitter glue fucking sucks. Glitter glue sucks. Just annoying. Just not that big into sparkly stuff in general. I, I, I'm not a huge sparkle guy. I've never liked glitter or glitter glue or sequins or little bedazzled gems. It's favorite base in baseball. <laughs> what? Which base? <laughs> Second base. I guess. Yeah, it's like, I don't even like, even if it was the cleanest thing in the world, I still would not like glitter. It's just too much for my eyes, man. It's just, and it doesn't even look good. <laughs> it's like, it's a, it's messy, it gets everywhere, it's a nightmare, and it looks ugly. Oh, it's 12.20. Well, I'm going to pass out. Cool. A glitter on cars. I don't like it. I like, like, I, I, I will say the other way is, is bad for me too. Like, like the, the big trend right now in cars is like really matte finishes, like a matte gray finish. I'm not big on that either. I like a reflective car, but I don't like glittery. Like I like a silver car or like a black car or a white car or something that's like reflective. Uh, I'm going to pass out. I like my cars to be reflective, but not glittery. Am I gonna have time to put in a load of iron? Why does it say load as if it's a washer? Jesus. You know what I mean. Probably. Uh, I might not have time. Let's push it though. Let's push it. One forty, one fifty, and we made it. Easy peasy, no sweat, and we're raking it in. Eighty bucks. That's right. Feel great. Jesus. Poof. We're going fishing today. Fruits all glitchy and stupid. Ah! Okay, there we go. <laughs> I had a bit of a struggle there. Please excuse the outburst. Okay. Um. Let's do that. 
And yep. Let's go check for tappers. And they're going fishing. Alright, how's that sound, babies? Okay, waiting on that one. There we go. Four left. One, two, three, four. Fishing day. Still only have the uh, fiberglass rod, so. Yeah. Do what we can. Uh, I might run out of bait partway through the day, but it's okay. Do what we can. Um, yeah, these fish are hard to catch without like a, the iridium rod or any buffs or uh, any of the like tackles. This sucks. Oh my god, that's so annoying. So we might. It might be a struggle, but I'll do my best. Oh, why am I losing frames? Whatever. Whatever. I'm gonna zoom in. I forgot to zoom back in after the mines. I like being zoomed in. Okay. I literally forgot. I literally forgot that I'm supposed to go bottom left. Jesus. Just zoning out. Just wandering around like a dingus. Like a dumb, stupid dingus. Okay. Whoops. All right. This is the most lucrative spot to fish. If you're talented enough to catch shit, which I might not be. Whoops. Give me the new shit, please. Stupendous. Yep. Literally impossible. <laughs> that exact pattern is impossible. Oh, that was my one cool fish. Now I'm gonna go back to catching shitty ones that sell for dirt. Helpful. Thank you. The coals, the coals appreciate it. Shit. This is going poorly. I've only hooked a hardfish once and I lost it immediately because it just hops straight up. Here we go. This one's like moving around. Not enough though. It's probably like something stupid. Yeah, cool. Ugh.
Butterfish. Butterfish. There we go. Damn it. God damn it. Balls. Dude, we are like not hooking interesting fish at all. This has been an unbelievably unlucky start to the fishing day. We're like dodging all the pricey shit. Come on. I've hooked one. I've hooked two good fish and caught only one of them. Jesus, this is unbelievable. I don't know actually what the like chances are of each of these So I can't tell if I just got really lucky my first two days in a row and this is more realistic or I'm just getting screwed this time around Again same kind oh my god, this is torture Wow! Is that six or seven? Is that six or seven of this exact fossil from fishing? It's either six or seven. Whatever. I'm in a bad mood. Another freaking wee wee fish. This is unprecedented. Okay, this one's interesting. Slightly. I should just focus on catching it for now. Never mind, it died. It immediately died. Oh, wait, it's come back to life. Might be a Dorado. Ugh. Come on. Modded fish. Jesus. God damn it. This sucks. This is so annoying. I got to look up the like encounter table for this river cuz Jesus. We're just dodging all the modded fish and I know they're not that rare cuz I got a ton of them the last couple times I came here. Here we go. I'm gonna lose it immediately. I might have died. Puppy, puppy fish. I wanted to see how much it sells for. Four thirty seven. That's good. I would eat the puppy fish. Yeah, I wonder what it tastes like. fish I'm gonna run out of time to even hook a king salmon soon they go away like I forget like seven something like that six or seven whoops that sound effect always freaking blows 
I lost track of my energy. Whatever. This day has been cursed since the start. How did I completely miss the little you're starting to feel exhausted, Linda? God damn it. Okay, this is something. This looks like a butterfish. Whoa, it just tried to juke me and I, I did not bite. I owned that one, by the way. That was a king salmon. Very cool. Okay, let me eat some of these. Okay, we will not be fishing tomorrow because I will start with an energy penalty. I'll probably just go back in the mines then. We're in a bit of a grindy patch, but it's fine. But it's fine. I don't really care. Oh my god. When it's down there, it's literally untouchable. God, it's really shaking. It's really shaking. Butterfish. Another dookie fish. Another ding dang dookie fish. Just throw it back in the river. Waste of space. God damn it. God damn it. That was like a worst case scenario. That was super unlucky. No, stop. God damn it. Annoying. Little asshole. Screw off. Interesting fish. Fish of interest. This could be a king salmon. No, it's, it's probably puppy fish if I had to guess. If I had to guess, and I don't have to, but I will, my guess would be puppy fish. Dorado, shoot me. Shoot me in the leg. Shoot me in the leg like you would a horse. Another Dorado. Oh my god. This has been such a crazy, unfortunate fishing trip. Just managing to hook all the lamos. Damn. Interest fish. It's butterfish. This pleases me. How many folks are here? 
just like silently fishing. There's just not enough stimulus. I'm not even catching exciting enough fish to make for cool TV. I just keep hooking literal newspapers. I was about to say shitty fish. That's even worse. Another one. Another one. Another shitty dookie fish. Oh my god. I'm gonna put the pole down. Like a like a like a sick dog. I'm not even gonna put it down like place on the ground. I'm gonna put it down like euthanasia. I don't know what the hook rates of these fun fish are. I'm, f I'm gonna find out. <laughs> Cause I'm angry. Stardew expanded king salmon. Stardew Valley expanded wiki. Forest West. Forest of the West, Aurora Vineyard entrance to Sprite Spring. In the bear shop. Massive pine trees and a small river for fishing. Neat. Fish. Several types of fish can be caught in the small river. Uh. Okay. There's nowhere where I can see the percentages. Harumph. All I know is that this has gone so much more poorly than the first two. It's because you ran out of bait. Bait just affects the time it takes to hook a fish, not the like kind of fish you hook, so it wouldn't be that. Plus I'd get a little message if I ran out of bait. Eh. Butterfish, thank the lord above. Uh, how much bait do I have? 70. Still got a good bit. Um, let's munch another one of these, I guess. Freaking whatever. We're almost at level 10. That's pretty cool, I guess. Just trying to kind of like find something to, to smile about these days, you know? <laughs> okay. Just trying to like smile a little bit. Forgot what it feels like. Treasure. Oh my god, you whore. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. You're embarrassed. You're, you're causing a scene. Another artifact that I already have. This is Quavy. Farts, man. There we go. That's a puppy fish right there. Gotta be. Oh no, it's probably Dorado or whatever. It's puppy fish. <laughs> I missed the treasure chest, but the puppy fish was the real prize. Honestly? I'm wasting my time. How about that? I shouldn't do that. <laughs> it's a waste. Uh, I should leave soon. It takes me a while to get back. <laughs> Stars aren't really out tonight. That's okay. Um, what happened? I left clicked like three times. I think I, I caught it in some kind of frame where I wasn't, wasn't taking inputs. Cool, bream, love it, fun, fun for all the kids. Hiya!
Ugh. Ah. Another bream. Another bream, which is really entertaining. And fun. Let's go until I'm out of energy. Eh. Mm, I don't want to push it and pass out. Gotcha, dummy. Oh, we're so close to level 10, dude. We're so close. We're not going to get it tonight, but next time we go on a fishing day, we'll hit it for sure. Another shark fish. Jesus, Lord above. Uh, I've got room for a couple more casts. Eh, this will be last cast. Last cast. God damn it. It's not one of these fart fish. I'm done. Last one. I'm leaving. We're done. It's the last time you test my patience. I put a Zuzu pet in my hair once. <laughs> I used to dress up my Zuzu pets and bring them to school. That can't have felt good. <laughs> what are Zuzu? Like, Zuzu Pet's one of those things I've heard a million times. So the name is in just is so familiar to me, but I don't remember what they looked like or what the hell kind of thing they are. Someone care to enlighten me on a, what a Zuzu Pet is? Hamsters on wheels. Thank you. What the hell is even stopping me right there? What is in my way? I'm gonna pass out and it's your fault. Like Star Wars beans. Oh, oh, the little bean guys? Mighty beans? Something like that? I think they were called Mighty Beans. I think. I could be wrong though. Um, let me put another load of these in. I keep saying load like it's laundry. We need more iron. Need some more iron. I'm going to bed. Good night. I've got to sell my fish. Ah! <laughs> Look at how low my dang energy is, dude. I can't do anything today. You can't say anything these days. It's my impression of every conservative comedian to ever walk the earth. Can't say anything anymore without some some snowflake getting triggered. You could sleep. <laughs> you know I could. It's a great point. Alright, well let me let me tap some some tap. I might I might just sleep, man, honestly. You you raise an awesome point there. We go. All right, this zone is done. And then this is our last one right there. Look at our tree farm. That's awful cute. Once we start getting harvest stuff, we can put them on the signs. Oh my, oh my. Checking Twitter. Thirty-eight 
there and blushing at his tree farm. Shut your mouth. <laughs> hey, shut up. <laughs> I'm checking Twitter. I'm checking Twitter. There we go. I wanted to, I knew Tristan Casas had a home run and I wanted to see it. Jesus. That ball was farted on. Oh my god. That's a hell of a nuke. I'm liking that. That's going to show up on my liked now. All right. All right, gaming chumps. Let's game. Uh, should I? Let me get some. Let's do, let's do a fruit harvest today. Daily fruit harvest. Yum. Okay. And then I'll get these ones over here. Mega orange. Okay. We got 20 oranges, 22 peaches. Look at that, dude. This is cheating. I'm cheating. I feel kind of bad. I'm cheating. Look at these sales. I'm cheating. <laughs> 10K for 22 peaches. What is, um, how much do peaches sell for in the base game? In this version, they sell for almost 500. A peaches is 140. <laughs> they like tripled, almost quadrupled the price. Sell price of these fruits. I don't care. I feel like this this playthrough, I don't know. This is a single player game, right? I feel like if people get pissed over me like cheating, that's their loss on this single player game. I Both things I really need to do right now require a lot of energy. I really need to chop wood and I really need to get iron. Um. Wait, I need to water my ancient fruit. Close call. I'm going to bed. Yeah, if this is an online game, what? Yeah, and I'm not gonna and, and like in a single player game like Stardew Valley, the only impact of cheating isn't like a competitive balance issue. It's if you cheat, there comes a point where it removes the fun because it's like you're not playing anymore. It's like spawning all the items. It's like, well, you're not playing the game anymore. This is just making my fruit tree dreams come true, is what this is. And you know what? Worst case scenario, people get pissed. Comment. You're boosting my video, dude. That claim that I always make, while true, is what really makes me feel like a, an asshole. Like, how freaking super villain is that to be like... By hating me, I grow stronger. It's true though. Every hate comment you send just made me a little bit of money. new characters that would have been really smart <laughs> but I went to bed that would have been a great UC yesterday actually god damn it I have a meaning to do that today's Victor's birthday all right let's let's make a point to give Victor a present anytime we get a birthday of a new character we should try and give him a gift I'm gonna look up right now what Victor likes
Victor. Victor lives with his mother, Olivia. Who cares? Both moved to Pelican Town after Olivia retired from working at Georgia Co. Recently graduated top of his class from a prestigious university with a bachelor's in engineering. Shit, Victor. All right, Victor loves battery pack. <laughs> That's perfect. I've got a battery pack. All right, battery pack for Victor. No blueberries left behind. Initiative. Starting now. Whoops. Level, what is that? 10, that's level 10. Artisan, done. Holy smokes. Oh my god, that's gonna boost my profits even more. Well, not really, because right now I'm pretty much just selling raw shit. But it's still huge. Let's go! Alright, I'm selling all of this. Well, no, because I need to save one for me center. There we go. Now. Did it auto play to a new? It auto played back to the Gone Fishing playlist, which I have already played on these streams multiple times, but I love it. So we're doing it again. Okay, Victor. Victor. Okay, how do we want to spend the rest of our day? Uh, could I? Uh, definitely not fishing. We're gonna mine for iron today. There's Martin again. We're like Sharton. We're having clearance sales soon. Five percent off. All right, see a farting. <laughs> we have fun. We have fun here. What are we talking about? I gotta, I gotta scroll up. Gonna drive my ass to a boost now. Oh, is that a? Oh yeah, you will need the rest of your body as well. Unless you intend on pouring the smoothie up your ass. That's the message I saw that I wanted to scroll up for. Alright, anyway. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I can't take it anymore. Root of the garbage. <gasps> Critical hit! Happy birthday, Victor! Your house is lovely. I might just like wander around your house for a while if that's cool. Happy birthday, we're up to three hearts with Victor. It's very kind of you, I love it. I received an email today with a job from a reputable architecture firm. It's all the way across the country. I'm not comfortable traveling that far away. That's okay. This dining room table was built in Grampleton. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Thanks. A book. I can't, oh, so I can look at the table, but not the book. Up, down, right, left, up, up, down. A, X, B, Y, B. That is so much. It's Chico for a video game. I'm taking a picture of this. I don't know if it'll come into effect in a cutscene with Victor. Or if I can just do it whenever. Up, down, right, left, up, up, down. A, X, B, Y, B, A, X, X. B A A B B B A A A. <laughs> okay. Sounds good, man. What a lovely table by the window. Game Informer. Best games of the year. Butterfly House. Can I play? I think there's a Ghost Station 1 and a Super Nindo entertainment system. Good for you, Victor. Okay, that's enough of that. All right, well, you guys have a lovely house. I'm gonna keep wandering around here. Wow, Victor, you got a hell of a library in your home. See you, Victor. Okay. 
I should have brought my mining stuff with me so I could go straight, but I'm stupid. All right, iron. Does anyone else have a crippling addiction to Monopoly Go right now? Can't say that I do. <laughs> right, what is Monopoly Go? We eat the rich victors first. What's wrong with Victor? I mean, I've called him boring, but I don't know if we should eat him. <laughs> he doesn't seem that bad. It's a mobile game. Monopoly mobile game. And I'm intrigued. Done. Tree farm done. Yay! Woohoo! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm out. I'm out. I'm free. I'm free. I'm running around. La da da. Da da da. I think Victor can hit the gritty. I think anyone can hit the gritty if they set their minds to it. Family's all in. Okay, now there are like three to five people separately hyping up Monopoly Go. Okay, well, now I gotta get Monopoly Go. <laughs> what is Monopoly Go? Monopoly Go is the best mobile game. Dude, everybody's freaking in on Monopoly Go, it turns out. I gotta write down a bunch of like shitty little stupid stuff I can do on like a one off stream. Monopoly Go is one of them. <laughs> Oh, gee, oh my god. You guys know how I always say I just almost threw up on a stream? Uh, strike the almost. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> At least this music <laughs> is nice. <coughs> I'm just wanna. It was only a little bit. <laughs> it was only a little bit. Back to work. It was, I'm not gonna go into specifics. But it was enough in quantity to, I think, not count as throwing up in my mouth and just count as throwing up. I've been doing that a lot recently. I've got like some whack thing going on my stomach. I freaking, I, I puked on the mountain when I went skiing this spring break after falling. I like absolutely munched, slid 30 feet down the mountain and threw up. Well, I threw up while falling. So I like was just sliding to the bottom of the mountain with my friend. I was just like, I threw up. <laughs> She was like, really? It's like, yeah. La 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 la. I have acid reflux and that just happens. Yeah, I mean, I have acid reflux as well, but it, I thought I had grown out of like throwing up in my mouth because it, it was, it stopped being as common like a while ago, but the past like couple months I've been throwing up out in my mouth like every freaking day. <laughs> it drives me insane. I just realized in the last month, this is so gross. Okay, anyone who is easily grossed out, uh, unplug your viewer now. I'll give you a 10 second window. Are we ready? <laughs> last warning. Okay, this is truthful. I don't even need to say maybe because I know this is true. Um, in the last month, I have swallowed significantly more of my own vomit than a carbonated beverage. And that's the truth. I don't like carbonated beverages. I have... I have drank <laughs> thousands of times more of my own puke than soda. <laughs> in the past month. Because how frequently I just like hurl in my mouth and then have to deal with the situation. I'm in class, so I can't like spit it out. I just gotta just 
be a man and <laughs> gulp it down. All right, that's all. <laughs> These wasn't carbonated vomit. Yeah, that would blow. That's a good point. Let's zoom out. Okay, I'm just after iron. That's it. Seventeen iron ore for the boy. That's me. I'm the boy. I'm rebranding. I'm rebranding from Therm to the boy. Can't believe you have a soda stream. I don't want it to be though. I don't like fizzy. And I'm neutral on vomit. La la la. Level nine, dude. My skills have been really good. I'm just file. Sniff. How about that? You ever met a guy with? A, a, a head voice as good as mine. I'm sad, dude. I can't freaking sing along as reliably to these songs anymore. Because when I sing along to these songs, I like to do it in my highest register. And now I can't hit those anymore because I have such bad allergies. I can't hit high notes anymore. My nose is always stuffed and my throat is clogged. So I can't, like, really lay into a juicy high note. And I'm really bummed out about it. I'll find a way to deal with it. If given time. Four fifty PM and I'm up to 131 iron like a swag guy. You're mine. Owned. Sick throat. Literally, unfortunately. Womp womp. You should make your own singing character in My Singing Monsters. Another really fun idea. Sounds like a great time. My sneaky monsters OC do not steal. Yeah, what would my monster be? What would it look like? And would it be a vo vocal one or would it play a little instrument like some of them do? Because some of them like just kind of like have a flute <laughs> and just know how to play the flute. Some of them make these these really piercing noises with grotesque, exaggerated body parts, and other ones are like, I can play the harp. Slimed. Oh my god, guys, I've been slimed. Oh god, I've been slimed. We're done. Ugh. My nose. Time out.
169 iron. Respectable. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. <laughs> I've been, I like, I don't know where this voice came from. I've been on a big kick with it recently. It just kind of came out like a few days ago. Uh, really late at night. I was like delirious. And I was like, sometimes, I don't know. I, uh, if I'm like really delirious, I'll slip into little voices more frequently than I already do. And this, this one just kind of came up that I had never really pulled out before. And now I'm like obsessed with it. The best way I can think of to describe it. Oh, f shit sake. Best way I can think to describe it is like, I think it's actually more biblically accurate to a nerd. Like a lot of times the nerd voice is like very nasally or very like a lot of like snorting and maybe a, like a expander's lisp. But in my experience, like the true kind of insufferable nerd type of voice is very breathy and a lot of soft S's. And I just like, I've been so addicted to it lately. It like, I, I'm trying to think of like a sentence that would work. Just something like, like I'm talking like somebody who raises their hand in your like a humanities college class and starts going off and then the teacher says something and like they'll be like yes I understand um I think we can come back to it later I've been on such a kick with that voice being like how strange the police themselves sometimes go over the speed limit really makes you uh, wonder if they even know the laws themselves that shit is all I can do right now it's ever since I like Cause that's where it, what happened first. It was like the policeman passed by, and I was like, "How strange!" And then I was like, "I've created something. <laughs> like I've, 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 I'm, I'm on fire here, and I just, and, and I can't stop. It's such a fun voice to talk in. It's a great time. Please look up the chosen from Smot. Is it? Is that it? It's legit that voice. Shane Top in a wolf shirt. I don't know who that is, but I. Trust you. I'm gonna look that up right now. Hold on. Let me pause my music. What do I look up? Uh, Smosh. The Chosen. The ch it's in, it's, there's a Smosh wiki page with The Chosen on it. The Chosen, whose name is Spencer Agnew, is a character portrayed by Shane Top. Introduced in September 2020 in the video playing Blackjack in Viva Smosh Vegas. He's made appearances in numerous Smosh... Oh my god, this is too much. He's characterized as misunderstood and harboring a sense of self-perceived power. The Chosen serves as a parody of the archetype of, the t of typically middle school boys who believe themselves to be akin to the main characters and media they consume. <laughs> That's, I mean, that is the kind of archetype I was imagining in my head. Personality and appearance. When examining the chosen's personality, it becomes apparent that it can be deconstructed into two distinct layers. Outward persona he aspires to present, and concealed truth hidden beneath. On the surface, he strives to exude the image of a resilient and modest warrior, wholly committed to advancing the cause of all humanity. However, beneath this facade, one can discern glimpses of a self-important, insecure individual at a younger age. These moments reveal someone who places a significant emphasis on the importance of being cool. Jesus. Okay, calm down. Alright, well, let me find a video with the chosen in it. Trivial Pursuit, Chosen Edition. Welcome to Try Not To Laugh Trivial Pursuit Edition. Chosen Edition. Okay, yeah. You know what? I, I totally, yeah. I absolutely hear it. It's the S on, the ch on, on that word is what did it for me. To Try Not To Laugh Trivial Pursuit Edition. Right here. Chosen. That like really soft whistly S is my freaking favorite thing when actual human people do that. Okay, back to work. That's crazy. Yeah. No, I hear it. <laughs> that's, that's really funny. Anyway. Back at it. God, that does sound like... Oh, well, now I'm sad. I thought it was my thing. That's okay. I mean, obviously, it was never my thing. Every voice forever has been done, but I thought it was my own mind, baby. And now I feel less attached to it as if it was a strange child. 
Have you ever heard of the cart narcs? I've not heard of the cart narcs. What time is it? 10 10. Man, it would mean so much to me to have minecarts to use for my convenience. There we go. Neato. Excuse me. Out of water. Mm. Hello. Okay. All right. I'm probably just going to bounce. Yeah. I'm gone. And then I'm thinking this next day, Wednesday the 24th, will be our last for this stream. And then I want to take the end of stream to, um, I don't know where my capture card is. It's somewhere. I'll have to set it up. I want to take uh, the end of stream. I want to spend the end of stream making a, uh, a new player in the new MLB The Show game. If I can figure out how to hook it up to my... PlayStation. Oh god, that's gonna be so annoying. Cause I gotta do. Yeah, I gotta unplug that. That's whatever. I can do it. It's fine. <laughs> eh, no. We're gonna save that for another day. Cause I gotta like figure out how to set it up. So yeah, we'll just play one last day and then we'll call it a stream. Sorry for folks who got excited about the baseball thing. I gotta spend like a whole... No! No! Final... I'm changing my mind one last time. We're doing it. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Regardless, this is our last day. This next one. And then I'll try to set it up. If I can't, then I'm ending the stream. If I can, we're making a player on MLB The Show. Done. Nighttime. Okay. Here we go. Level 10 farming. Done. Artisan. It's the best one. All right. <laughs> Look at that. Almost six figs. And we have another... Um, Blueberry harvest incoming, so we can spend a lot of that on fruit trees, which I'm gonna do, like, right now. Only... There we go. Okay, I'm gonna water my ancient fruit. That's the first thing I'm doing. Before I forget. There we go. Oh, wait, let me... Dummy, Jesus. Okay. There you go. Thanks. Okay, let's go uh, plant our one new ancient fruit. New blood. Shit. <laughs> Welcome to the family. Oh, god damn it. I want my pickaxe so I can remove that. Okay, now. This song is way louder than the rest of the songs in this playlist. Now, what to do with our final day? I want to make a bunch of bee houses, but we just do not have any maple syrup yet. And it's going to be a while until we get some. So I think what we should do is we should go buy plenty of fruit trees. It's a Wednesday. So shut up, stupid idea. Uh, we're going to cut wood. We're going to spend our last day cutting wood. Boring, I know, but we're doing it. Cutting wood. <sighs> Stretch. Let's 
That voice I was talking about earlier is also the voice I hear in my head uh, when I read Twitter replies I disagree with. Like when MLB The Show announced that they were um, adding the option to make female players. And of course, I don't know, baseball is like the most hate crime ripe sport. Eh, probably football, but baseball is pretty bad too. It's just, they're both just very traditional white guys. Um, so of course, the vast majority of baseball Twitter was very upset. Uh, with how unrealistic it is to have a woman in MLB in the video game where you can name your guy like Thunderbitch Fartstein and have him hit 600 foot home runs and then float over home plate. Literally, there's an animation that makes you float. Um, but yeah, every time I read one of those, that's the voice in my head. Seems strange. The female player? Oh, I'll believe it when I see it. Shut up, bitch. You're stupid. <laughs> There's something so raw about just calling someone stupid with no no pomp, no circumstance, no bells and whistles. Ah, what a shame that my favorite franchise is going woke. Another day, another video game going woke on me. Happens, I suppose. I want to watch you drown. I like this voice. Thanks. I'm gonna keep working on it. I'll hone it. Next time it'll be better. up to 400 wood like a boss <laughs> gonna, gonna get back into that as well it's a good it's a good phrase they get perfectly embodies the character that's what I'm saying like you're telling me when when these kids talk like like in the intro to psychology class I took and these freaking horoscope idiots kept raising their hands being like, sure, your textbooks can explain away, but I've seen the stars. The stars tell stories. Burn to death. I will say the one, the one shortcoming that that voice doesn't work for astrology, because in my experience. The, uh, the astrology folks in psychology were, um, were more like the kind of valley girl where it's like, yeah, but have you seen the stars though? Like, I'm not trying to like step on your toes or anything, but like, it's very, I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's very Virgo. It's very Virgo. My skin crawl. I just hated psychology. Every single person in that in that field is annoying as fuck. Ev no exceptions. I've never met in my life a psychology major. To my knowledge, I'm sort of playing people that are psych majors I don't even realize. But in that case, you'd be the exception to this rule. For the most part, I know when someone studies psychology because they insert it into every fuck as a psychology major, as a psychology major, as a psychology major. You don't have to start every sentence with as a psychology major. I don't care. I do not care. Happy for you that you're into this thing and you've studied it. Nice. I don't want to hear about it. It's in every field, but Jesus. I'm going to keep eating these fruits.
Oops. Hat mouse. I should check in with hat mouse. See, see what hats are for sale. This will be our last trade. Mousy. Okay. Um. Oh, what the hell? These are like reskinned. <gasps> yeah, I'm not changing hats. I freaking love my straw hat. Are you kidding me? I'm leaving. All right, that was good. Almost a stack of wood. That's uh, let's see, 960 just about. A bee house requires 40 wood. 960 divided by 40 is 24. So I have enough for 24 bee houses. It's actually less than I would have thought. But that's fine. I've got more than enough iron. Iron's not really gonna be a problem anymore. It's gonna be wood and maple syrup, and of course coal, because 24 bee houses, eight coal a piece. That is 184 coal. No, <laughs> it's 192 coal. Jesus, come on, man. Multiplication, you can do it. 192 coal. Uh, yeah, wood is actually gonna be our limiting resource. Well, maple syrup above everything, but then wood, then coal, then iron. Bedtime. Bedtime. All right. Get into a groove here. Stardew Valley expanded. Exit desktop. All right. I'm gonna try and set up this capture card thing. Okay, let's see here. Where even is my capture card for starters? Here it is. So, this is the output. Um, this can, that was only gonna be. This is the output. That's, oh wait, no, 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 that's the output. This is the input. So I'm gonna swap these. Let's see here. I gotta. This is HDMI. It is stem from. Oh, I gotta have my capture card just like live down here. That would be so convenient. I don't know if I can get that to work. I might not be able to. I just opened something by bumping my computer. I just opened Premiere. Just because I bumped my freaking whatever. Okay. Uh, one of these goes into the monitor. while live streaming okay it's plugged in so let me try uh opening the elgato game capture hd let me turn on my ps5 <laughs> and let's see it's powering on. Come on, please. Oh my God. There's a moment. There's a moment where it looked like it was turning on. No signal. Damn it. Okay, hold on. 
Let me drag this over here. And then let me switch my input to my PlayStation input to see if I am indeed online on my PS5. It sucks, man. It's, it should be working because it's just the HDMI cord into there, into there. Oh, it's my PlayStation itself is like freaking out. Yeah, it's my PlayStation itself. My like monitor will not display it. Why? Oh my god. HDMI 2. This is so annoying. My monitor like keeps snapping me back to the other. Ugh. Okay, hold on. Yeah, there's some kind of update going on or something that, like, my computer won't allow me to... Hold on. Uh, LG View Sonic Monitor. How to turn off uh, input switch automatically. Oh, yeah, it's just everyone's online complaining about how shitty this monitor is, which I agree with, to be fair. This monitor sucks for the price. I should just get a new one. It's plugged in, right? Yeah, it's just like... Completely busted. Does it still do this if I don't... Why? Everybody's having this issue. Oh, okay. There's some setting thing I have to go through on the PlayStation first. God damn it. I gotta unplug. So annoying. Okay. So I gotta unplug that. Plugged into my monitor. Now my PlayStation is confused. How? What even happened that would have caused that? Jesus. My headset broke. Everything broke. Plugging in the Elgato. Okay. 
Elgato is the only company that gives um, Adobe uh, a run for its money for the worst technology award. Elgato, I've always complained about their stuff. Of course, the second I try to plug in their capture card, it breaks my whole computer and PlayStation. <laughs> My headset is disconnected now from my PlayStation. I don't know how it's even possible. I didn't do anything that would have caused that. Let me try just resetting this PlayStation because I just don't understand. Oh my God. How is this possible? How did it break my headphones? Whatever. This is stupid. <laughs> I didn't even do anything and it broke everything. I just tried to plug in. Whatever. Plugged in a capture card. This is to bust my whole setup. Okay, hold on. Um, Elgato no signal PS5. Like place, the PlayStation 5, just like PlayStation 4, has HD CP turned on by default. You set it to disable it. Connect the PS5 settings. There you go. Navigate to HDMI settings. I wish you could tell me how to get there. Navigate to the HDMI settings and disable HTC people. How do you navigate to the HDMI settings? I need to figure out how to turn off HDCP. So it's not screen and video. System? HDMI. Here we go. Enable HTCP. Off. I thought it broke it <laughs> for a second because everything went dark. Okay. Now. Let's try again. I gotta unplug. Shout out Reddit, man. Reddit, if Reddit goes away, my career dies. Reddit is just such a reliable 
source of tech help. Okay, now, ideally, Is it playing my Switch audio? Or my PS5 audio? Is it playing like ambient <laughs> chords? No. <laughs> what the hell? Why was Switch audio set to whatever? Uh, properties, device. Yeah, no sound is being made right now. How do I... Oh, Jesus. Switch audio. Device. What the hell, man? Oh, my God. Okay, hold on. Now I got to figure this shit out. Elgato HD 60s how to get audio in OBS I don't want chat link Jesus Google sucks I literally have to put reddit at the end of every single Search. Oh my fucking god. Elgato blows. Alright, here we go. Check in the Elgato game capture software settings. Oh yeah, no audio is playing here. Yeah. Okay. Um not edit. Don't edit. Oh my god. Settings. Nope. Game audio. How do I get to like audio settings? What is going on? Okay. Should be under HDMI. Ugh. This software, man. Makes me want to cry. It's so bad. Capture, sharing, updates, hotkeys, advanced. Dude, just give me audio settings. Oh my god. This is crazy. It's completely busted. Oh my god. What the hell? Okay. Elgato game audio not working. And I have to put red at the end or else it won't work. Because Google sucks. Elgato not picking up game audio. Yeah, nobody helped out. I fixed it. Deleted the capture utility app and reinstalled it and it works again. So for a while I'm trying to figure out the audio settings would be my last time I tried recording it before update. Really? I have to delete the app and then reinstall it? Oh my god. 4K capture utility. What is that? Install update. Here, I'm going to switch. Well, no, I, I have to stay on the black screen because it's the only way I could hear the audio. 
Oh boy. Okay, I'm installing for Oh wait, I have to close this. And then I have to switch to this. And then I got to Man, really? I got to do all that again. And install the update again. Holy shit. I'm having so much fun right now. Install. Ugh, really? I have to close OBS? Dude, oh my god. The only way I can fix this broken software is by deleting it and reinstalling it. The only way I can do that is by closing my stream. Fart hole, dude. Alright, I'm gonna have to end this stream. <laughs> and, then I, I, and then I make a new one. So this con thus concludes. So for people who watch this VOD later, part six of Stardew Valley, they're just gonna have, there's gonna be like a 30 minute long period of tech difficulty that then just follow like concludes in the end of the VOD. But then we're gonna start a new stream. We're gonna make a character and then I'm gonna end it. So I'll be right back. Everybody stay, please.